Today, I'm gonna tell you guys the story of me being homeschooled. That's it? <laughs> oh. End of the video, give me your money, thank you very much, bye, see you next time. <laughs> the first question most people ask me is why I was homeschooled in the first place. That sucks, I don't remember asking. <laughs> when did I ask? Do you, do, why am I even in this video? Oh, and to clarify, I was only homeschooled in my high school years. Anyway, when I tell people I'm homeschooled, they think it's just so I can play video games all day. Joke's on you, I didn't have any friends to play video games with. Uh. <laughs> uh, 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 uh -huh. The other reason people would think is maybe I was anti-social. I mean, they're not wrong. Look at you now. Look at me now. The real reason I was homeschooled was actually to have more time for a sport. No, it wasn't toe wrestling. Whoa! Well, then, I was just wow. about to ask that. Well, I was going to say, I know you weren't thinking about that, but did you know that's actually a sport? Like, I just figured it out, like, the other day. D1 in toe wrestling? Yeah, it exists. There's no YouTuber what? toe wrestling? Imagine when? getting a sponsorship to college for toe wrestling. Wait, there is actually toe wrestling. Yo, I'm calling out Jake Paul right now. The winner. <laughs> toe wrestle me, bro. <laughs> what if they have like warts and stuff on their foot? Yeah, I know you do. Would, would that be an advantage? Yeah, fungus. Imagine like you're basically making out with another foot. Is it illegal to make your toenail sharp? <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> He's asking the real question. Use a knife. I played a sport called tennis. But get a lot of this guy. He put it sticks and balls. Oh my God. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> Well, not to get sidetracked, but the reason I was homeschooled was I was able to train more for tennis so I could get into a top D1 school. Everyone can agree on me on this. Like, school takes up your entire day, all right? By the time you get home, you only have a couple more hours left where you usually have to do homework anyway. Just don't go to school, lol. Well, what is nice about homeschooling is it allows me to go at my own pace. So I would usually finish my schoolwork in about two hours or less for the day. Oh wait, that's kind of lit. That the entire rest of the day, I could do whatever I want, meaning I could train more. That's also which allowed me to start my YouTube career and more importantly, my Heroes of the Storm addiction. Oh no. <laughs> ah, yes. It's not an addiction. It's a lifestyle. I didn't choose the game, the game chose me. <laughs> Most people think I was taught by my parents. In some people's cases, it's true, but not mine. Some people, like, their parents would be like, walk outside, look at the trees for their science class, or play Assassin's Creed for a history lesson, all right? That's not what happened here. I was taught by a computer. Hey, Alexa, teach me math. <laughs> Give me math knowledge now. Teach me one plus one. <laughs> what I mean by top of the computer, I meant there's courses online that I read through and then I take a quiz that is graded by the computer. But anything written is graded by an actual teacher. There is also no schedule, so that means you could do as much or as little schoolwork as you want. As long as you get it done by the end of the school year. This means you could do absolutely nothing all year and finish everything the last day if you wanted. And that's exactly what I did. Oh, <laughs> how did you manage to do that? Yeah. Let's start from the beginning. On my first day, when I like sat down in front of my computer, I was expecting some sort of orientation or something, but it was literally like, I opened my browser and it was like, here you go, do school now, right? Oh. There was no structure, no assigned times. You could do as much or as little as you want. And because of this, there was a huge responsibility on my shoulders. <laughs> they expect me to make my own schedule. I still forget to floss my teeth or even brush my teeth. You know, you know what really helps helping with your assignments? Just do it tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, for the first weeks, I mean, <laughs> first couple of days, I, I took upon myself to learn, study, be on track, a good kid. I was a learning man. It was great. Good man. Adapting. But then things came difficult. I was taking AP Calculus online. If you're someone who likes math, let me just give you a firm handshake right now because congratulations, you're a genius. The main problem with homeschool is that it's so easy to do something else, all right? Just one click, one tab, you open up YouTube. Literally just turn your head away from the desk. You have your Xbox controller on the floor. Another turn to the left. Your cat's just sitting there, you know? He's just looking more adorable than usual. Because of this, I hit myself with that one-liner. You know what? I'll understand this tomorrow, all right? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> yes. boy. The procrastination. Yo. It's happening. It's starting. <laughs> and I did this day after day eventually it was weeks oh boy uh -oh. and like i said there is no punishment for this as long as you finish everything by the end you pass months 
And I mean months go by. You're just you're like playing. trapped, like in <laughs> you're just playing here the storm in the animation. Yeah, yeah. Like, all, the, no. the whole entire months, everything going by, and you're just in like a room playing here the storm all day. Ed. We were about two weeks by the end of the school, right? Two weeks left. All my other classes were finished. 27 weeks of earth science and literature, all complete with flying colors. I did those on time because they were nice. I understood it. I studied Wait, uh, wait, wait, wait. Sock, sock, sock. So you're just saying hey, Doki Doki Literature Club? Oh, please, please. Get rid of him. Get rid of him. Please. And I, I even submitted my last quiz in for gym. Yes, homeschooling has a gym class. What do you do? The thing about, let's say, gym class, all you had to do was log an activity. And I love that system because you could basically say whatever you want. You could lie. <gasps> oh, what a lie. So no, wait, my, my YouTuber, my favorite, you would never lie, bro. <laughs> It's not lying, you just bend the truth. I did 50 bicep curls with a mouse. Well, it's not like I needed more fitness anyway. The whole point of the homeschool was so I can play tennis like six hours a day. Weird flex, but okay. Wait, do you go to field trips? No. Field <laughs> trips on your own? That's so sad. Wait, wait, do you join clubs at homeschool? Like, you know, like you join math club or something? Why would you join a club? Homeschool. You're gonna join like a book club with like Barbara and Beth that are like 80 years old. <laughs> Why Barbara and Beth? Like, this is like the most old uh, people like name. <laughs> exactly! And they're the most likely to join a book club! Oh, guys, I can't play after school. I have. I have uh, anime club with Uncle Ronnie at 2 a.m. <laughs> 2 a.m., bro? We're watching Attack on Titan season 4. <laughs> I don't know what else you're doing with your uncle at 2 a.m., man. That's kind of okay. Uncle Baji. Oh. Uncle Baji kind of sus, bro. Anyway, I was about to walk away from my PC, and that's when I see it. AP Calculus sitting on the top left of my assignments that are due. It totally left my mind all these months. So if you didn't <laughs> know, a school has about 27 full school weeks. And I just submitted my week 27 assignments on all my other classes. But AP Calculus was still there on week one. I didn't even get through the first week. Oh God, oh, burn it. And there was only two weeks left before the end of school. Oh, so your internet went out. <laughs> They can't do anything if Inter is out. What are they gonna say? Like, that's, that's an true. extension, that's bro. True. My internet was out for the past uh, 11 months. Yeah. My dog my, my, my assignment. I was grounded at home. <laughs> I was grounded <laughs> from homeschool. <laughs> at the age of 17, I didn't think it was possible to have a heart attack because that's exactly what just happened. How am I supposed to do 27 weeks of AP calculus if I can't even pass the first week by myself? There was only one thing I could do, and that was. To cheat! Oh, uh, yes. Now you're no. Cheat? I mean, no, no, cheating. <laughs> <laughs> what? What is, well, what is cheating? Should be easy, right? There's websites like Mathway that solve questions like instantly. You just copy and paste. Pow, 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 pow. I can give you a list, bro. Oh, how I was wrong. The questions weren't just math questions, all right? There were math questions with words! Why does that exist? Oh. It was about the man with 900 shampoo bottles. And you had to figure <laughs> out why he had 4,000 watermelons, all right? Those were the questions. Shampoo. It gets worse. Turns out these questions, you would think Yahoo Answers would come clutch, but no. Turns out these questions were customly made for that yearly of school, so you can't cheat. All right, there was no Google. Then use Bing. <laughs> 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 this means I would have to learn. No. Oh, no. I windmilled my entire desk away. It was time to study. I canceled everything I had to do those weeks, all right? Even the play dates. I'm sorry, Jimmy. No! Jimmy from Mr. Beast? My mom tried to lecture me about responsibility, but even that had to wait. At the rate I was going, I was finishing an entire week of math in just one day. I was actually learning though. I never felt so much pressure, but at the same time, it was nice to have a schedule for one. But at the end, it wasn't enough. I wasn't gonna finish in time. I still had 10 weeks left on the last day of school. I failed. Oh, <laughs> what? Wow. Dude, why do you speak these stories? You need to like have like some sort of pause or something. <laughs> Staring at the camera. I <laughs> In desperation, for the first time ever, I emailed my teacher that I needed more time. I never met this person or talked to them in my entire life or in this entire time of school. But 
I will never forget this time, Miss Johnson. Turns out I was submitting things so fast that she didn't even have time to finish grading them. For the first time, I was actually thankful for math questions that were asking for show your work because that means the teacher actually had to go through and grade it. He comes over like, oh, explain how you did this. Explain how you did this. I got you. <laughs> beat up the teacher. <laughs> I'll show you. I'll show you how I, I'll show you my work. You want to see my work? means the teacher also needed more time to grade stuff so that meant i could actually get an extension how much more time i needed for my school <laughs> Dude, if i was a teacher i would have just failed you in the end i was able to finish my entire class of ap calculus in just under a month and actually learning a thing or two Jeez. a thing or two you're telling Wait, me you're shit. just extremely lucky yeah pretty much and that was my experience homeschooling and the lesson here is make sure you have a schedule so you don't get in the same situation i was in